Beth. Macbeth isn't too bad, I don't think. Whoa. They're all starting off on the ground. What's with that? Whoa. Gotta kill. Kill, kill, kill. Oh, so much slowdown. ceiling sometimes, because objects fall from there. Shit. Yeah, those from up there. And you also have things sputtering out of volcanoes like that. I suppose the, the lava planet from 64 is kind of like this, but they really haven't done anything kind of undergroundy like this since this game, as far as I'm aware. better to do. Lucky for you, there wasn't. You're lucky I didn't suit you down dead. I mean, if, if you're so low on health, why don't you just let Falco or somebody be the one who's in the front? Fuck. Why the hell is it slowing down? Oh, right. I think I pressed the wrong button. You're slowing down with uh, volcanoes shooting uh, rocks down at you is probably the time you don't want to do that at. Not that I did it on purpose, but still. Peppy's not much better, really. To deal with this guy. Oh yeah, you suit the things on the bottom, right? No, you don't. It's things on this. Well, it's kind of this side. Ugh. Missiles. Okay. I'm gonna go to the right here. Understand this. Are you supposed to suit those glowy things? Shit. I don't know how you're supposed to evade them either. Phew. Used up all the bombs, but that's okay. 
I used up all the bombs, but that's okay. I used up all the bombs, but that's okay. Because if I didn't, then I would have died. You may as well use your bombs before using your life. <laughs> yeah, join the club. Be like Falco. He doesn't give a sweat. Hmm. I know there were enemies I missed on the walls, but I don't know how you're supposed to get them when you're going so quickly, unless you just really have to slow down a lot. Anyway, at some point I'm probably going to cut this in half. It might be before now, it might be... Well, I mean, the thing is, since this is the last level, you know, <laughs> how that goes. It's like, what do you do with that? This is good for directly aiming, but it also has some dis- what? Yeah, yeah, barrel oil doesn't always work. It's always slippy when he's the lowest on health. He always gets in the way, too. Why didn't that count? No, oh, whatever. It's always you when you're running away, Slippy. This level cool is that there's a lot of things to suit, but it's not necessarily... Well, it's really just suiting a bunch of stuff. And, like, it's just enough to be satisfying, where you're, like, suiting all these things down that are coming directly at you, but it's not also insanely difficult, at least not so far. shouldn't worry too much about the score and worry more about the getting health. Oh shit. boss is a little weird. It's like it's easy in a way, but then it gets harder at the end, which makes it kind of frustrating. Because then it's like you wasted all your time to get to the part that actually is difficult. Huh. I'm still not sure I even understand it. Pay more attention to the health bar and see what happens. Like, those went down. Mm -hmm. And then at some point it starts shooting at you when you're making the pass. And then they, they close down. They act more defensively. I think it just saw the laser. Now it's shooting again. I 
making another pass. Oh man, it's hard to begun this phase. Looks like I really got it right this time. Now I just need to survive. If, this, if the controls were as responsive as I think they should be, I'd, I'd probably be blocking a lot more shots. Gotta focus on that defense. Don't worry so much about getting the shot, I guess. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Eh. No. That didn't seem to do anything. level again. Let's go. And then there's a whole Venom level after this one. Good luck. Anyway, the thing about this one is it, like the cursor returns to a, the, the center of the screen. So yeah, you can aim better, but it also... It's kind of mutilated by the fact that it goes back to the center. Which I'm sure is useful in a way. But, uh, for what they're going for, it's kind of counterintuitive. Uh, maybe not. I don't know. Exciting scene. Looks like they're shooting the missiles from down on the planet to try to intercept you. And it's just like... definitely can't suit at something until it's dead. You have to suit at where you know it is, and then, uh, know to go to the next enemy, because if you, you'll, if you'll only start suiting at the next enemy once the first, you, you're certain that the first enemy's dead, then, uh, that enemy could give you trouble, because it's gonna start firing at you, or, or the other object. I mean, it's the same logic, just it 
goes to a bunch of different enemies at the same time. Anyway, the point is... I always have that problem of... Uh, wanting to shoot at the enemy until I'm certain that it's dead, but you shouldn't do that. You should move on to the next enemy. I'm, I'm sure there's a better way to explain it. have this much range. Well, that went down pretty well. Oh, yeah. I like how they get better aim as they have fewer lasers. <laughs> That thing could basically only fire forward. The where it's shooting the laser balls. Because you notice they shoot off to the right there. Like they always shoot over there. And then that laser comes directly for us. And then it starts firing at us. The the laser balls. And then the regular lasers. Well they have a little more direction. I just gotta get the timing for when you can... Fuck. Why am I going the other direction? I think these bosses are too complicated. And, uh, it's not really very cool to have the level start and then you, you can't react to the next missile. That's not very good design. I mean, maybe it has something to do with the uh, SNES Classic slowing things down. Maybe. I don't know. how I figured it out the first time. I mean, I think I know how now. It just doesn't work. And I don't know why these guys form up. They're clearly more effective separated. And that thing has more mobility and it suits at you a lot. And then they form together and it's just like, no, not anymore.
you shoot at them directly now, or do you have to wait? Like, do you have to shoot at the other side, like you did before? It kind of looks that way. But this game doesn't, you know, let you do a proper barrel roll, so you'll never find out. Because if, if it did, you could actually... Do you have to... I guess you just have to go down right away. from before that I got? Why don't we have it now? Just do a bomb right here. I just okay. That part was the only one that was open, so nothing happened basically. I wish you could actually do the zoom in mode. That that would actually be useful this one time. Well, not this one time, but it would be useful. Figure I may as well use up the bombs. I mean... Shit. You're gonna die anyway. Well, like I said, for the first boss, except that one was actually, you know, effective. actually even let me suit at the two. If I you try, even try, it makes it so that you're too close. And then it sends you going backwards, even though that doesn't make any sense. If I can get through this in one life, you know, maybe it'll be enough to give me an extra continue. Oh, well, maybe it actually can't, because I can't get the score enough, even if it's a 100%. I'm not sure. I'm still not quite sure how that works, because I'm if I got the 95 that one time, it I still don't get how that works. Anyway, the only time it's going to be even remotely worth it to get to Andros would be uh, if I don't die because otherwise you have all that other states to go I think 
this is also more responsive. That might explain some things. I guess they're... I don't know how else they'd imply a stronger seal, but it looks more like invisibility than it does just a stronger seal. But, you know, like I said, what else can you do? the shield anyway. I mean, maybe it is just a limited time. I mean, on top, like, you can run out of it just because you use it up or because of time, but I don't think that's it. But then, I don't really remember running into all that many things. Fuck. Of course, those lasers barely do anything. Those, on the other hand, might be a problem. Let's do it for real this time. Or not. so hard because there aren't as many lasers. Fuck. Okay, where where was the laser? Very funny. It's in the back there. Why isn't coming out? So do you have to suit at the right side or something? Huh. Maybe you have to suit at the bridge, and then it'll make it so that they want to take more defensive measures? I saw a laser go into it, and I think I saw the enemy health bar go down a little. Hmm. 
it's hard to tell with how choppy this is if something's not hitting or if it is and isn't registering if that's even a thing. Oops, I hit the wrong button. I meant to slow down, not the other thing. That makes it harder. It's counterintuitive. It's going down now. Maybe it goes down when you slow down. Okay, now it's down again. So do you have to get it at mid-range now? Seems like that's count well counter to how it's been in the past, but who am I to argue with this game? Okay, now it's just down the whole time, so you have to suit at the bridge, or somewhere, just anywhere on it to make it open up. I wish you didn't have to approach from the front. Like, why does that make sense? Why would Fox do that when he can come from the side? I, mean, I know it's also flying around, but you should be able to, you know, go to the left and then come from the right of the ships the port or whatever. Okay, open up, open up, open up. No. What is this game? Oh, now it opens up. up my bombs, but whatever. Oh, is it not over? Okay, it is. I don't understand how I did that the first time as, like, I mean, I know I still had the same kind of problem, but it wasn't to the same degree. Now I only have one, I mean, a couple lives, but only one real shot at Andros. 92%. What is that? Wait, Slippy died? Oh, oh good, I continue. Well, good riddance. Now maybe we can get rid of Peppy too.